Hello and welcome to the Outpost RV. My name is Jeremy and today we're going to take a look at the Grey Wolf 20 RDSE. This camper comes in at 25 feet, 3 inches, tongue to bumper and weighs right at 4,300 pounds empty. As we get started up front here, we have your power tongue jack with an LED light so you can see at nighttime when you're hooking up. Two 20 pound LP tank bottles that will be filled by the Outpost RV. They also have the hard shell cover here. We have your diamond plate rock guard, curved radius front end. Up front here, we have some storage with a magnetic door catch. You can see the lots of good storage in there. We have the LED light incorporated as well. We have your uh, stabilizer jacks, two in the front and two in the back, as well as a 15 foot power awning. Each leg is adjustable. Now if the sun's coming down, you can adjust the pitch of the awning there with the blue LED accent light underneath it. Also right down underneath, we're gonna have this holographic light with the wolf head emblem. So at nighttime, that'll really illuminate and separate you from the rest there. Sturdy steps going in where each leg is adjustable if you're on different levels of ground. Oversized grab handle. We have your full-size entrance door, which is the black tempered glass, integrated window, and a full-size screen door as well. Um, directly underneath, we have an LP quick disconnect. So if you have a portable gas grill, you could take it with you, tap into that and use the gas on the camper. Outside entertainment center where your speakers light up blue. We have your TV bracket right here. It's the same bracket on the inside. So you can simply take your TV off, bring it out here and set it in with all your TV connections here. We have your furnace vent. You can see the center cap is popped off. All four wheels have uh, quick easy loop axles as well as self adjusting brakes and tire pressure monitoring systems and how that works. This will turn red if you are low on air. So I will unscrew this to demonstrate. That way you can just walk around and do a visual check before you head off for your next destination. We are pet friendly. We have your leash latch so the furry family members can tag along. Four inch tube bumper for your sewer hose. Travel rack with the spare tire that is included. In the top right, it is prepped for a ladder. So you can buy a telescoping ladder separately for roof maintenance purposes and your backup camera is included. This is a 30 amp unit. It'll come with a 25 foot detachable power cord, cable satellite connection. So if the campground offers that, you can plug in right there. We also have this bright LED light over here by your water connections and your dump station. That way if it's nighttime, you can see what's going on. We have your low pressure water sprayer here with the outside shower with hot and cold water. Black tank flush, so when you're done camping for the week or weekend, you can hook your water hose up here and that'll blast out the tank for you. And down below, we have your water fill connections. On the left hand side is your fresh water. So if you're dry camping or boondocking, you can fill up your fresh water tank, turn on your water pump and use that water. If you're at a campground, you will hook up to the city water and that'll pressurize the lines for you. And then down below, we have your dump station where the gray handle is for your gray tank and black handle for the black tank. And last but not least, we have your on-demand water heater. It is on-demand, so it's gas only, but you're only using gas when you're running hot water. And that'll conclude our outside walkthrough of the Gray Wolf 20 RDSE. And now we'll take a look at the inside. As we move to the inside, you'll notice we have another Gray Wolf light shining down there. Another neat feature that Gray Wolf adds. Get a nice overview of the camper here. Great layout. Nice and spacious floor plan here. And we'll get started right inside the entrance door here. Up top is going to be your main control panel. We can see how full and empty your tanks are. Turn on the water pump, your lights. Run your awning in and out as well. There are 12 volt heating pads on all of your holding tanks in here. Overhead cabinet storage there. Large kitchen window. We have the high rise faucet with the pull out sprayer. 110 outlet over here. And then your furnace duct is gonna be ducted through the cabinetry. Storage down below underneath. Farmhouse style kitchen sink here, nice and open. We have a three burner stove with the glass cover so you can use that as prep space if you are not cooking. And then directly underneath that, we are gonna have your microwave, which is also a convection microwave and an air fryer. And underneath that will be your furnace. 
To the right of the stove, we are going to have your TV bracket with the TV connections on the wall there. Up above with your stereo, it is AM, FM, and Bluetooth compatible, so you can sync your phone to it. There are inside and outside speakers. Overhead storage here. Lots of windows in the back. We have this large U-shaped dinette, which will also turn into another sleeping area for you. And storage underneath all of the seats here. Over to the right hand side, we got more storage up above. And then we have your pantry area right here. The refrigerator is 12 volt. We do have solar on the roof. There is a 100 watt solar panel already mounted up there. Your breakers and fuses are on the left hand side. We have a voltmeter. And then the red key is a 12 volt cutoff switch. That will kill all power to your battery for you if the camper's in storage or if it's not in use. It'll keep your battery charged up for you. Again, this is a 12 volt refrigerator. It is deeper than the gas electric. So there is more storage inside. As we move up front here, we have your thermostat. It is a digital thermostat to control your air and furnace. In the bathroom area, as soon as we walk in, we have your toilet directly inside, storage underneath, nice sink here in the bathroom, you have your 110 outlet. Over to the right, we have your thermostat for the on-demand water heater and a light switch, medicine cabinet, and at the very top, we have your large exhaust fan. That is a multi-speed exhaust fan. In the bathroom, above the shower, we have a skylight. We'll have a shower curtain that pulls around. And this will have a uh, shower surround as well. With your sprayer and the hot and cold water down below. And now we will move up into the bedroom area. Got this nice tall window over here. Beside that, we have a 110 outlet that has a built-in inverter. So when traveling, you can use that 110 outlet even if you only have 12 volt power. So another great feature that Gray Wolf adds. Hanging storage on both sides. Overhead cabinets up above so you can utilize that as storage while traveling. Queen size mattress. Comforter is included here. Another 110 outlet on the other side of the bed. And directly beside that is going to be a docking station for a Bluetooth speaker that you could purchase separately. And you could keep it charged up right there. And that will conclude our walkthrough of the Gray Wolf 20 RDSC. I appreciate you guys watching. If you have any questions, feel free to contact myself or Henry at 866 338-9845. Thank you guys for watching and have a great day.